Releasing food to Nigerians will not help you. Primate, Elisha, I the latest President Bola Tinubu. <laughs> Nigerians, the founder and the pastor of Irish Evangelical Spiritual Church, Primate Ayodele, has decided to pen down a message for President Bola Ahmed Tinubu with regards to the food insecurity challenges faced by Nigerians in the country. Primate Elisha Ayodele, who gave such counsel during his prophetic section, which was uploaded on his church's official TikTok account, stated that the federal government's decision to release food to Nigerians will not provide solution to the increased level of hunger faced by the people, adding that President Bola Metinubu should crash food prices if he wants to combat such issues. In his words, I want to tell the federal government of Nigeria, this food you want to release to Nigerians, it will not help you. President Tinubu bringing out food will not help the, the society. I say, crash the prices of food items. When you crash the prices of food items, it will help you a lot that will be that will be total breakthrough by the time you bring down the price there will be there will now be a, a crash that is what the lord said to me if you like get angry i daily finally advised president bola Tinubu to partner with states that are into massive food product production adding that the Naira will continue to depreciate if the government does not encourage local production and constant electricity supply. See, when you look at what he said, he just said the truth. If you like, eh? If you like, carry 10 bags of rice, be giving it to Nigerians. It's not going to help matter. Yes, don't forget that they will eat this rice it will get finished. And don't also forget that it's not only rice, it's the food Nigerians eat. So you know the roots of this issue. Go, hit it, hit the root. If you like, give people food. And the worst part of it is that by the end of the day, the food will not even get to those you want or you plan to give them to. Because politicians will first of all focus on their family members and friends. That is the truth. These people, they don't deliver. Sometimes federal government dish out these things, but they don't give it to those people who are really in need of those things. Yes. Oh, they don't give a mark to don't finish just like that. Are they really giving out to giving giving these things out to those people who really needed it? Giving out food just like what he said will not help the matter. The only effective measure for now is to bring down the price of petrol and let there be tax force to monitor the prices of food and uh, goods uh, all over the country. You understand? That if, if, if there is something like that, everything will be regulated. Because even as I'm talking to you, if you go to the market now, things they not even increase. People, they increase them on their own. And you not go feel blame them. If they still sell their own finish, they will still go buy from people, buy another things. And they are, they are not buying it cheap. That is the reason why when you buy something now, after four hours, you, you won't get that particular thing at that, at that the same price. So it is it's worse. It's, the, it's worse as that. You understand? If you like, begin to share food. Don't forget that those food you are sharing will finish. Like as I said, the only way out is bring down the price of petrol they told us that with the first subsidy nigerians will live where are we really living where they told us that there are some individuals who are benefiting from this first subsidy you understand that after they remove the first subsidies nigerians will now enjoy the real dividends of democracy even when we feel that oh it's not it's not okay with us they always tell us to you know, uh, comply. 
everything and we we we, we, we they follow but at the end of the day nothing they come out from it nothing they come out from it now nigeria is not like no man's land people barely eat food to eat to sleep people don't they go you know they go to sleep without food in their stomach it is really very bad the situation is bad you understand so it's not by uh, giving out food that we end this matter you know where to touch touch it nigerians are not smiling now they don't they gather small small they, they gather small small now like this then they, they come instead of you to face the real thing the reality or the standards this is not by you know this is not joke they are busy saying opposition parties are the one instigating nigerians instigating nigerians to protest that they are hungry is that making sense at all when you know that people are really hungry things that you're supposed to take serious you're not going to take them serious opposition opposition parties are telling nigerians to say they are hungry it does not make sense it does not make sense and that is why we are not learning and that is why we are not improving because everything now they they do they they they, they use for politics everything now they use for politics they know they use hunger for politics so nigerians are hungry so this government should do something and they have to do it very very fast i better make a drop and for you i want to see waiting on your daily talk so let's hear from you what's your take kindly drop your your comment below the comment section and subscribe to this channel if you're just joining us for the first time share this video let it go viral let Nigerians understand what is happening in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you for stopping by.